All right, every day, hundreds of thousands of Metro Atlantans write checks and drop them off in the mail, but we are seeing a growing number fall victim to theft and forgery. Bill Liss is investigating the depth of this problem and what you can do to protect yourself. It's called check washing. You put a check in a street side postal drop box to pay a bill or give to a charity. But when you get your bank statement, you find out that same check has been totally altered and made out to someone you never heard of. Your original check, stolen from a postal box, was washed and changed. Atlanta postal inspectors say it's happening with increased frequency. When they steal a check, they actually use different solvents and put different names on there to go to the banks or any check cashing facilities. The Atlanta police say the theft starts even before the thieves get to your envelope. What we've seen a lot of is actually where the, the keys were being stolen from postal carriers. They were being robbed of these keys that get into any of the boxes anywhere. But there's another way that's more brazen. They're using tools to pry them open. Um, also, they could be using fishing devices, and that's basically where they put sticky substances on the top of the boxes in order to fish out the mail. Combating the phishing scheme, Green says most Metro drop boxes are now being equipped with anti-phishing devices so the mail cannot be lifted out. But while law enforcement races to track down and prosecute the thieves, it's the victims who face a long road of paperwork. The Georgia Bankers Association urges check washing victims to frequently monitor account transactions, set up fraud alerts, and switch all direct deposits to the new account number and as a safeguard. Walk through all of your direct deposits with things like your employer, Social Security, Medicare, uh, as well as any automatic payments you have that may be coming out of that account that's been closed. There are two important ways to check to make sure that your check is not going to be washed. The first, mail them from the post office. The second, if you're going to use a drop box, make sure that you place your check into that drop box before the pickup time. Don't ever leave the check there overnight. But there's another way to avoid check washing hassles. Go electronic and pay online whenever you can. From downtown Atlanta, Bill Liss, 11 Alive News. Atlanta police say they are having success in catching these mailbox thieves. If convicted on felony charges, they could face up to 10 years in prison.